Good morning. I am here with another Tech Tip Thursday for you. And with the recent cold spell, we've been doing a lot of communicating with students. So I'm going to do a little series about different ways you can send messages to students. And I'm going to start with Apex, OK? So you can message individual students by clicking on the plus sign in Apex next to messages. You can also send an announcement that will go just to your classes. So if I click plus sign on the announcement, um, once it loads, I can choose just my classes. So I can select Media Lit, and then I can scroll down. And by holding the Shift key, I can actually select a series. So I can do All of English, right? Do Select All. Uh, oh, <laughs> remove all. Do Select, not Select All. Select. So if I come to English, just one little button off, huh? Um, scroll down, hold down my shift key, and do select. And now I have the English classes um, for the most part. We also have our reading skills. So we can select those. And so I can give a title and a body, and I can send a message to students just for this particular day, right? So I can come up here and change my date really annoying because it comes up with the little uh, bar in there. Okay, change my date, my end and my start date. So my beginning date would be the 18th. My expiration date could be the 18th. I would actually make it the next day. So I would make my expiration date the 19th. So tomorrow this announcement will go away. Okay, and then once I post these, I hit submit. I can also preview. Um, right now, it's not going to show anything. One thing you do have to do is you have to scroll all the way down through the list of students to see the announcement. Um, oh, so let me put something in here. Test, test. And I can hit preview so you guys can see this. Um, it's going to come up as an announcement, and it's going to say test. Right? And for students, that would just be announcement up there for their class, right? So there would be a date and there'd be an announcement here. So this is one way that you can send a message specifically to students in your class. Um, I feel like Google Classroom probably has a better communication method and I will talk about that next week. Hope you guys are doing great.